Man, I'm up here trying to watch Chocolate Man in Thailand, boy, but y'all gonna be mad at this. Y'all be getting mad. I don't know why y'all be mad, but this is really what's going on. I can't make this shit up. What are you doing? What are you, what are you doing? You realize when you do this, they gonna think I made you do it, or, 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 or I'm supposed to be doing it. What's going on, man? What, you washing your own bike? It's a car wash down the street. They gonna, you know they gonna blame me, right? You gotta understand, in the Matrix, they need something to be angry about. You know what I mean? They gotta tap in, you know? They're not gonna understand this. Can you explain this? Like, I ain't seen you do this yet. What's Sometimes you want to have time for me for me to do Oh. I'm glad you're telling them now, because they, uh, somehow they're gonna blame me for this, but you are doing an amazing job, I must tell you. Come on. I'm the Travel OG, and I traded in my Hollywood lifestyle for the sexy beaches of Pattaya, Thailand. We're bringing you exclusive interviews, showing you what the golf courses are like, the caddies are like, what the homies like. Zoom to Thailand with your man, Richie Matt. The Travel LG. All right. As the sun rises, I'm almost finished with the episode you're watching right now. I love to see how the day starts in Thailand. The aroma of different foods being prepared, people on their way to work or school, driving past an amazing Buddha. Even the jumpers hit different out here. All net, no stress. All right, Matrix Challenge. How many, uh, how many, how many women you know will clean any type of motorized vehicle? I didn't even know she was doing this. I just came outside and seen her like, uh, I didn't even know you could do it like this. She got, she got squat. It's that Asian squat. How do y'all do that? All Asians know how to squat down like this. What's going on, everybody? It's Andrew from the Fung Bros, and I'm here to talk to people about the Asian squat. Asian squat! But hold up. What is Asian squat? The Asian squat, also known as the Eastern squat or yoga squat, is when you have both of your feet flat on the ground and your butt is pointed down, almost touching your heels. It's pretty similar to the way people are taught to squat when weightlifting because of its stability and it's less strenuous on your knees. I don't know if I can squat, if I can get back up. Let me see if I can squat down like that, if I can get back up. She getting all on the rims and the brakes and shit. You ain't on the rims. What I noticed about Thai women is that they don't sit around and complain. They get up and make things happen. Whether it's running a business, gainfully employed, removing a tree. All right, y'all. Showing y'all. Look at mama. I'm over there getting the work in. Homies is watching, but mama's over there getting it. Look, she tired now. She like, is she all tired? I mean, she literally pulled the tree down, kicked it over, dug the hole. She taking a break. Where in the matrix? Look at they all smiling and happy. This is amazing to me. How they work together, how they happy. They're not getting a lot of money for this, man. I'm not sure what the owner's paying them, but they, but they just replaced my palm tree. Now they about to put some baby palms in there. Here come the squad, here come the squad, the Asian squad, there it is. Asian squad! No, this is what Thai ladies do? Thai ladies clean the motorbikes when they need to think? Wait, you know? Dang. Just, I have time. You got time, yeah, you do got time. You hear Chocolate Man over there talking, he's taking what's your clip. Chocolate Man did me dirty the other day. That dude caught me on blast getting a facial. But he said he took it down, so shout out to Chocolate Man in Thailand. Yeah, I can't see nothing, baby. We, I know they want to see something, but they can't see nothing. And then they even get mad if I talk about your big old leg. They be like, why you always talk about her big old leg? It be some dudes out there that really be like invested in the hate. Traffic is a serious issue here in Thailand, as well as the Philippines, as well as any other major city in the world. In Southeast Asia in particular, motorbikes are absolutely necessary to get around town swiftly. In the first eight months of 2021, the number of registered motorbikes in Thailand was almost 22 million units. For those of you who don't know, you're definitely going to need a driver's license to ride a motorbike or even a scooter out here. And you definitely need to wear a helmet. 
Not only is it the law, but you got to protect your neck. If you're visiting and you want to rent a bike, you need an international motorbike license. I'm pretty sure you can get one of those online. It's not expensive, and neither is written a motorbike in most cases. If you're from America or the West, driving in Thailand is the same as driving in England. Everything's on the opposite side for us. This can be very dangerous and confusing, especially if you've been sipping on something, which I highly suggest you do not get in any type of motorized vehicle if you've been sipping on something or toking on something. You dig? Most vehicles involved in accidents were with motorcycles, making up 83% of the total accidents, which can lead to serious injury or even the D word. According to the Bangkok Post, Thailand holds the number one spot for the D word due to motorcycle accidents in the world. Here's a fun fact. When you ride on a motorbike taxi in Bangkok, <laughs> you're going to need a diaper because some of the motorbike taxi drivers get busy. <laughs> On this side of the world, motorbikes are absolutely necessary, so safety is definitely a priority. Obey the laws, wear a helmet, and remember which direction you're supposed to be driving on. And don't worry, for those of you hard-headed people who think you can just jump on a bike without the right paperwork, if they catch you slipping at a checkpoint area and you're not wearing a helmet, number one, or your paperwork isn't straight, they'll hit you with some serious fines. And on top of that, the inconvenience of having to go to the police station and pay along with whatever else you're required to do is not my idea of a good day. So make sure you observe the laws, make sure your paperwork is straight, wear a helmet, and make life easier on yourself. You dig? Now, back to L. Working at the car wash. <laughs> Clean my bike when you get done with this one. Oh, I find you not dirty. <laughs> what well, you mean not dirty? You gotta be dirty. You cleaned it already? They're gonna be, they're gonna be mad. All right, yeah, I'm just letting y'all know. She wanted to do this, man. This is what she does for her own therapy. She likes to clean up. You can still hear Chocolate Man in Thailand. Ladies and gentlemen, let's see what Chocolate Man in Thailand is. What is he talking about? He's probably feeding five because they be eating. Oh, he's doing stuff for the children. He did that too. That's the Chocolate Man in Thailand. Doing things for the children while I... Elle is over here cleaning the motorbike. Chocolate Man, you see her cleaning the motorbike? I can't... Has Fa ever done this? This is a Fa challenge. Y'all want to see Fa clean the motorbike? I mean, it has to be her idea, because this is Elle's idea, not mine. Just letting everyone know what it is here. And they're all up in the tires. Really? You, you must be doing some serious thinking. You almost out of soap, no? You almost out of soap. Chocolate Man was handing out stuff in the village. You hear that? He's handing out stuff in the village. But the bike looks nice, though. But I'm serious, no need. You need to hook mine up. My bike ain't as nice as yours. See, that's another thing too. See, I bought Elle the nice bike, and I got the little. Yeah, she got the good bike. See, I'm gonna show y'all my bike. The little uh, Eero. You understand me? And I'm happy with my little Eero. It's not as nice as hers, but if I can get her to wash this, y'all gonna really be mad. Elle, you wanna wash my bike? Boy, you want lah? I the Oh, you want lah? You, not me. <laughs> I guess it's pushing if I ask her to wash my bike. Y'all will pull y'all hair out y'all head. That's chocolate man. He says he might need another cart. That dude's voice be transferring, boy. I'm we're way over here. Chocolate man's over there doing his thing. Yeah, you really getting in there with the rims and all that. You should get a job at the car wash place. You should get a job at the car. She's even cleaning out the inside. My. So this is like the trunk for bikes, y'all. Y'all don't understand. Like, this is where you put your helmet and all that. They're very efficient with stuff. You know what I mean? This is your little iPhone joint right here. Stuff here. And then you got another little compartment there. Mine don't have all that because mine not nice like L's. Go shopping with boyfriend. That's far. L, can you feed the fire? You got to feed the fire. Yeah, they they getting food for the for the Thai people. 
Like y'all used to do. Remember you and no, you? No, I want to give you the. Kids don't have father, mother. Uh huh. Yeah. Because I want this one. You want to do it too? All right. No more candy. No more candy. You hear that? That's Chocolate Man says no more candy. Tired of fighting with your girl? Tired of dealing with the same stuck up women when you go out in the States? Tired of these fake ass IG models begging for cash apps? Fellas, I'm here to tell you, you don't have to settle. The women in Pattaya outnumber the men 20 to 1 out here. No matter your age, your race, your height, or even your weight, they don't discriminate. They don't discriminate. Think of mine? Zoom to Thailand with your man Richie Mack. The Travel OG. Make sure to like and subscribe to all my videos. You got questions? No problem. You balling on a budget? No problem. You scared of rejection? No problem. It's impossible to fail here. Book a consultation, become a Patreon member, make new friends, and join the family of Zoom to Thailand. Your life will never be the same. Your boy is out here changing lives, y'all. And as promised, I'm always going to leave you a little something for the end. Would you look at that? I can't make this shit up. <laughs> make sure you get your mind right. Make sure you get your grind right. Subscribe, share, and let all your people know. You got to zoom in Thailand. You did. That you want to do. Maybe I can do Thanks. the things that you want to do. Let's do. About that time, you know what? I, you know what I'm gonna need you to say, right? L, say theme music. Theme music. Theme music. Zoom to Thailand. Hope you coming too. Uh -huh. Richie Mac, travel OG with celebrity interviews. Get your passport, let's go. let's go. This is what you need for show. Brothers in Thailand, and bikini babes at the beach. If you need more, he got it popping. Caddy the other day, we golfing. Really ain't a better option. Time to travel. Like, subscribe, and leave a comment. Let's connect. Uh, Richie Mac, yeah, we steady vibing. Take a journey, let's get moving. Cause we zooming right to Thailand. Hey, Richie Mac, travel OG. Let's go. Make sure to like, subscribe, and notify. The algorithm is real.